now know the lineup for the men's semi-finals at Wimbledon. Boris Becker is through, but not without more complaints about gamesmanship. He will meet Goran Ivanisevic. Pete Sampras will play Todd Martin. Graham Miller reports from Wimbledon. Boris Becker says he's innocent. He doesn't know what the fuss is all about. But on set point against Bergstrom, Becker, the former champion, was at it again. Up goes his hand. Bergstrom is baffled. His volley goes out. The Swede insists Becker put him off. It's clear Becker <coughs> raises his arm, querying the shot. Overruled, Bergstrom's livid. More controversy for the second set. Becker, at the crucial moment, goes to his chair and towels down. Watch now by the assistant referee. Ungentlemanly behavior or not, Becker eased through to the semi-final in straight sets. The center court crowd delighted despite the controversy. I don't like what's going on for the past two or three days. You know, I'm doing the same things for the past 10 years. And all of a sudden, this is not supposed to be fair play. Do you feel there's a bit of a conspiracy against you at the moment? Well, the main problem is Andre Agassi is out. <laughs> and, and you gotta find a guy to fill in the space. The cheating row is already hogging space in the papers. Becker moodily left Wimbledon tonight to spot up on the rules, but already the lawmakers are investigating. There are rules there that, uh, that will penalize somebody who deliberately distracts or tries to intimidate his opponent. But that's always a matter of judgment. And I guess it's the, uh, the umpire referee to judge that sort of thing. But it's been going on for a little while. Tomorrow, Martina continues her march to number 10. Nothing to do with politics, just a record number of titles. And if she leads any incentive, victory in her farewell Wimbledon will take her winnings past an unprecedented $20 million. Graham Miller, News at 10, Wimbledon. And that's the news. Good night. Versus Holland and Belgium versus Saudi Arabia. The final two matches in Group F of the World Cup were played earlier this evening. We've highlights coming up in just over 10 minutes.